The black man in America has been made drunk. The black woman of America has been made drunk. Drunk with her wine, drunk with her heroin, drunk with her crack, drunk with her mollies, drunk with her homosexuality, drunk with her urban garbage radio mess, drunk with the stupid box that you watch on TV every day. Now, why are you being drunk with this that is consuming all of your mind cells and your energy? What are you doing with it? You are actually projecting that which is in your mind. You have been made drunk and you still want to drink. The drink of death, the drink of destruction, the drink of no value. The drink of not being able to raise your children because they'll all be in the land of zombies. And if they don't be in the land of zombies, they'll be in chains. Most of it is contributed to the rap music that they listening to and the movies that they see. Like I said, you got a liquor store. You got weed now, legalized weed. You got a church, all three of those along with the rap music. Church music is just as bad as rap music. Did you hear me? Church music is just as bad as the rap music. Have you ever noticed how all of these rap stars talking about killing people and, and, and selling drugs and tricking off with women, how all of them happen to have on a Jesus piece? But I never really caught how they always talk about death and destruction and how they instruct your children to disrespect you, instruct your children to beat you, instruct your children to disrespect your women, instruct your children to go use drugs. And they wearing a Jesus piece. <laughs> wow. Masses of manipulation. Masses of manipulation. Our young black people are in trouble. Now, if you ever look at another 48, where I was talking about the teens that's locked up behind bars, you should see some of the cases that these kids have, and most of them are murder. And it's all over dumb shit. So what are we gonna do? I say that we should ban these rap artists who speak about doing drugs. I say that we should ban these rap artists who continue to have our children devalue themselves. I say that we should ban these rap artists. They're leading our children to self-destruction and you know it. And some of you old cats, you even know it, but you're not saying anything about it because you listen to the same dumb shit that these young people are out here listening to.